I've got one more act in this section. This guy has been supporting this comedy tent for at least the last eight, nine years since I've been here. You're going to love him. Please, if you want to come forward, come forward. It's going to be fantastic. I want everybody in the place to raise the roof for the one and only, the fantastic Carl Dean. Yeah! So I know Carl, I just said to him outside, break a leg, and he said, fuck off, I can't walk. <laughs> sang to it. It was acoustic. <laughs> he sold it for a one pound and it came home a million times. What do you get if you cross a parrot with a pigeon? Voicemail. A friend had bred a messenger pigeon with a wood. <laughs> Not only does it deliver a message, it knocks the door when it gets there. <laughs> Pigeons must have a lot of money, as they have no problem putting deposits on expensive cars. <laughs> Whoever designed the lions in Trafalgar Square really put the cat among the pigeons. <laughs> comedy this year and he said yes I can do a comedy slot so I was really excited I went back to the tent at full speed and hit a bump and my wheelchair took off in the air a bit like Dukes of Hazard are flying through the air but in a wheelchair even a pigeon shit on me <laughs> I can't stop and the barbecue was getting nearer and nearer, nearer and nearer. Who oh, fuck and crash bang wallet. And yes, I knocked over the barbecue and the hot coals went all over the grass. My friends was pouring water all over the grass and calling me a dick head, not head and many more words. But they put it out while I was watching them and more importantly drinking my beer. <laughs> Let me tell you again. 
yet. But I found the sail of the So we had to wait for one hour for the York train to come. Good job, I had a few beers in my bag. And then I went into the bushes for... Like Egypt. 